Apparently, we need to have a pretty serious discussion. In regards to this special pack, we currently have one. I am going to use it on the level 80 XP reward path pack once we get there. Now, I had a lot of people in the comments of the last video, and I knew this was coming. I anticipate it. I even, I hear where you guys are coming from. This thought process went through my mind when I was putting the rules together for the series this year. If you're new to this series, rules are in the description down below. We're gonna play one ranked game. Based on how we play in that game, we'll open packs after the players we get out of those packs are the players we can use on the squad going forward. Now, in previous years, we kept the bank. Anytime I pulled duplicates, we would put those stubs that we get for selling the duplicates into a bank. We would use the bank to buy more players. Problem was there wasn't, you know, you didn't, it took forever to grow the bank. We only you really spent the bank on a couple of players throughout the year. And since we only used the special pack on like Fallen as a Habits all year, we never really got anything good out of them. We uploaded over 100 episodes of Pack Squads last year and we were still using base live series players at the very end of the series. Knowing that, I wanted to implement a way for us to get some OP cards on the team that are gonna last us all year. I don't want us to get to a point 30 episodes in where we have all the live series cards, we never make upgrades to the team, and we're playing against God squads in championship series every game with a bunch of live series cards. It gets a little less fun that way. As I also stated in a lot of the comments and on the last video, we got two special packs, one in back-to-back -back videos. I made it a lot harder to get special packs this year in pack squads. I know we got a rage quit in back-to-back -back episodes. We, we may even get a couple more as we climb through the rankings, but we are playing on veteran and all-star difficulty right now in the lower ranks because the game just came out. Naturally, we're gonna play some people that aren't that good right now. Once our rating gets up, that's going to change. Competition's gonna get stiffer. Games are gonna be tighter. There's gonna be a lot less rage quitting. I would actually say once we get over seven, 800 in ranked seasons, the only way we're gonna get special packs is if we get a mercy rule, which again, not gonna happen that often in the higher ranks. Special packs are not gonna happen that often. That's why I am okay with using them on OP packs, including XP reward path packs. We're really just not gonna have that many of them. Although I understand too early. That's why I used one of our special packs on a ball and as a habit in the last video. I promise you, I'm gonna do everything in my power to make sure that this team stays balanced and it's not too OP too quick, but I also wanna make sure that the team doesn't fall behind and struggle to compete later down the road. So I hope that all made sense. We're gonna jump into our ranked seasons game today. This is the squad. Whit Merrifield, Jose Ramirez, Pete Alonso, JD Martinez, Trevor Story, Fran Mel Reyes, Manny Machado, and Yasmani Grandal. I'm gonna slide Yasmani Grandal up into the sixth spot. Now, this is what I'm gonna do, right? I really kind of want to use Mitch Garver, and a lot of you guys said this in the comments last episode, that we use Grandal almost all year for MLB 19, so let's use Mitch Garver. I agree with that. The problem is our lineup is extremely right-handed heavy right now, so we're gonna use Grandal to keep the switch hitter in the lineup, but once we get a left-handed stick or two, then we'll put Mitch Garver behind the plate. If you wanna see episode seven of Pack Squads, I will post that on Saturday if this video gets to 3,000 likes. Also, I posted our first pack and play of the year earlier today. If you wanna see more of those, go smash the like button on that video. It's a simple series, I open a 20 pack bundle. The players that I pull out of that bundle are the players that I use and I go head to head against other creators and streamers from around the community. And I'm gonna be doing that all through the summer. So if you wanna see more, definitely go show some support on that video. I'm pumped to do those, playing against some of your favorite YouTubers and streamers. I got a lot of fun guys lined up that you guys are definitely gonna wanna see. So again, tons of content coming on the channel. Today, we're gonna try and keep the ball rolling on pack squads. We are five and oh so far. Let's make it six. All right, all right, all right. He's got Tom Seaver on the mound. We're going to debut James Paxton. He's got that Evo Diamond, Yvonne Rodriguez. He unlocked the 85 Curtis Granderson. I like it. Raul Mondesi at the top of the lineup. I like it. A little early, good looking early grind squad from this guy. He's also 14 and 5 in ranked seasons. Let's see what we got for him. Good rip, Wit. Ah, it doesn't sneak through. We might beat it out. Nice play up the middle. We didn't hit that ball hard at all. 
chop that one with a hanging curveball. It's gonna be a tough one. That's actually ended up being a routine play. Two rough swings here to start it off. Pete Alonzo steps in, nobody on two outs. Good spot to power swing. Bang! It's one nothing. Good time to power swing. Goodbye, my lord. My lord, Pete, the polar bear. One down, Monty gonna fly out to right. We got a man there, Fran Mill. Not taking him out of the lineup until he stops hitting, <laughs> which he hasn't done. Pudge out to right, almost the same animation there. We got two down on six pit, five pitches. Change up straight down. Get out in front of that. Take a seat! There's a pack. Let's hit. Oh, yeah. Yasmani Grandal is going to debut with an extra base hit. What else is new? It's all he does. It's all he does. Machine. Fran Mel out to right. There we go. There we go. Harper will shoot it to the cutoff. Man, what runners on the corners? Fastball down misses. 1 0. We're button. Squeezing it. Squeezing it, James Paxton. Way to get it down. That'll work. That's twice already. Hey, man, the suicide squeeze works. People got to be more cautious pitching the pitchers with less than two outs and a runner on third. Got to be more cautious. Wick comes up, runner in scoring position. Ah, that was ball four. I chased it. I chased it. All right, we get one more. Let's get another goose egg and win the inning. Ground ball up the middle, nice play, strong toss, one down. Curve ball here, 1 0. Chop it. Chop it. Shift may have worked out a little better there, but I'll take it. Two down. Oh boy. Just stay in the yard. Dude, I give up more home runs that go over by a hair than anyone in this community. I'd rather you put it on the upper deck than barely get it over the wall. Good change up, rolls at the second. What? That was routine. He's gonna get a challenge pitch right here. Fly ball out to left. Story will get to that one. Into shallow left. He gets there, but he missed it. Throw comes in from Martinez. Thankfully, he made a base running mistake, so we're gonna get out of this. But seriously? Mondesi gets one through and out to the outfield. It'll be a double. With Merrifield, a little lackadaisical getting it in, and Mondesi beats it in there by a step. Pudge steps in to hit. Pops, that's huge. No way that's deep enough to move him to third. Mondesi will stay at second with one out now. Perfect toss. Got him. Got him. Back to the bench. And the cutter right into the shift. Wow. We both made a base running mistake. Machado, deep out to right. I, I don't like okay contact there. Okay, two down. It'll bring up Fran Mill. Ripped. Still have the lead. Cassiano's leading this thing off here in the top or the bottom of the fourth. Good curveball. Granderson hit that ball well. It'll move the runner up to third. Maybe. Ah, Jose, Jose had to jump for the ball despite the green throw. I'm going to walk Luke Voigt and set the double play ball. It's a little bit early to be putting the, the lead changing run on base. But I want, I want to get out of this inning unscathed. Way too much plate. That's on me. Perfect toss, perfect toss. <laughs> we ended last inning with two missiles. Hey man, the suicide squeeze works. People gotta be more cautious pitching the pitchers with less than two outs and a runner on third. We're gonna throw him out at home and that'll end the inning. He gets three, it's four to two. Ground ball into the shift. Second out of the inning. 
Live ball out the center. That's a quick one, two, three inning for Michael Givens. We go to the six. We've got to get at least, we got to cut it in half here. Alonzo, JD, Trevor Story. Let's go. Let's go. These barrels got to get down. Pete Alonzo. Good squared up hanging slider. His second of the ball game. It's four to three. That a boy, Polar Bear. That'll put the team on your back. Let's go. And there it is. It's traveling out to right. We didn't barrel that up, but it travels all the way to the warning track. Slider away, misses 1-0. Grandal up, two outs, nobody on. Good time to power swing. And there it is. Good, good. Power swing out the center and gone. Three solo shots on the inning. It's four up. Come on. Now we're getting rewarded again. Now we're getting rewarded again. It's back. Missing that fastball up. Oh. Chest high a lot. He's going to keep throwing it. Machado rips one out the right. That perfect, perfect will get through. And we're... Oh, I thought we were out at first. I was going to be livid. <laughs> Two out, one on now for Fran Mel. Power swinging on that. It'll be a missile out to right. And we'll have two on with two outs. We're going to go to the bench again here. He's probably going to take Seaver out. We're going to go to Devers. Get in that gap. Get in that gap. It'll get down and he dove for it, so it's going to score two. It'll be a two-run double, a four-run inning. Three with two outs. Keep it moving. Top of the order coming up. First pitch slur from Batanzas gets away and hits Granderson. First pitch slur out in front of one. He probably didn't think I would throw it again since we just hit Granderson. Got him. Got him. Why, why are you frozen? Run him down. Thank you. One down. A little over aggressive trying to steal bases there, bud. Fouls it off. Man, that ankle high breaking ball still gets a ridiculous amount of swing or foul balls versus the swing and miss. <laughs> Man, if I've been sne if I've been getting those animations on top of all my barrels in this game, I would have 20 runs. They're keeping him alive. It, uh, Fran Mel got a bad jump. Of course he did. Of course he did. Uh, of course he did. Never smoked that ball though. All right. Um, I'm actually going to warm up. I'm going to go to a righty real quick. We'll go to Con Tommy Canely. I don't want to bring the lefty out here. We'll bring Canely out into the game. Two in scoring position, one out. I can't believe that he just started a rally on that garbage swing with Luke Voigt. Slider away, chops it. I, I mean, I'm sitting here spamming throw cancel, and he just doesn't. Chase one. Take a seat. You deserve it. Went right down the middle, challenged him, and he missed it. We fly out to left. That'll end the inning. He strands all of them. Oh, my heavens. I, I barely, I mean, that is just in on the barrel. Timing was good and all. He almost got our third of the game there. Brings up JD, who's 0 for 2. What is this pitch mix? Surprised he didn't offer at it. Throw to second for the four shot, and the side is retired. As a hitter, you just have to tip your cap and... 3-2 changeup. Fly ball out to center. We'll have the man there. We'll flag that one down. One out. Bryce Harper steps in now. We got the lefty-lefty here. Front door slider. Pop! Team up! Two down. Way too much plate there. We're lucky he didn't hit that out. He did hit it out, didn't he? It's off the wall. Pop team up! Roman gets through his first inning at work. No damage, just the one hit. Let's get some insurance runs. Smoked. Grandal with a multi-hit game. Leadoff man's on. Again, I don't understand the okay contact there. He hit it 93. It's in the PCI. No way. No way. These good square double play balls. Come on. Fran Mel, get it back. 
Hanging off speed, perfect, perfect, no doubt about it. See you later, we're watching that one. Woo-hoo-hoo, Fran Mel, that's why we don't take him out of the lineup. It's so beautiful. Look at that flip. Bang, absolute seed. Good curve, gross, that's gross. There's a pack, take a seat. Uh-oh. That will score a run. It'll be an RBI double. Hanging slider again. That off speed has gone to the exact same spot every time I miss this whole inning. Good fastball. Pop team up. Huge second out of the inning. Let's get out of this thing. So, what are you doing? What are you doing? That had to be an accident. I'll take it. Ha ha. Oh my heavens. He's lucky that wasn't a moonshot. Pete Alonzo with his third hit of the game. We were power swinging. Pulls it through the hole on the left side. JD's gonna come up. Cutter right out over the plate. JD with the good squared up line out to the warning track. Oh. We need three outs. I really hope that doesn't come back to haunt us. We better win this game. Avoid that. I don't, I don't. Thank you. Oh my goodness. I, I, oh man, all my misses are going in the exact same location. It's making me nervous. Wow, Pudge went up and got that one. I know he's been looking for the fastball the whole game, but my God, I didn't realize he would hit a home run. I mean, yikes. Fly ball out to center. Harper got under that one. We got two down. We need one more out. Take a seat, Nick, ball game! Let's tally these packs. What an insane game. I mean, my God. I could have easily scored 10 to 15 in that one. Let's tally them up. All right, we had three walks. We had 12 hits, seven runs, four homers, one stolen base, four strikeouts. We threw out one potential base runner and we won the game. That's 33 packs. We get a bonus two packs for the 10 hits. That's 35 packs in total. 35 standard packs sounds like a diamond to me. And we're going to continue to wait for that level 80 XP or Warpath pack to spend our special. What a game. There will be 11 left when we are done. Let's get after it. Let's get after it. Uh, Jeff Samarja. Football player. Football player Jeff Samarja. Okay, okay, okay. Nothing in that pack. Come on, baby. Come on. Come on. We need a, we need a two-way. We need Ronald Acuna. We need a two-way outfielder, come on. Tyler Naquin. Actually, we need a lefty for the outfield. We need Cody Bellinger. We need Belly Bombs. Yachty, okay, okay, okay. Not what we're looking for. Silver John Lester, again, not what we're looking for. Come on, come on. Nothing there, come on, baby. I'm telling you, we're gonna get something good today. We're gonna get something good today, Matthew, Matthew Boyd. Still though, my favorite part about this year, the silvers and golds having so much value on the market and even gold players being so playable in game. We're still hitting nukes with Fran Mel Reyes, the bronze right now. Love that. Hunter Dozier, he's another card that hits bombs too. But it's nice being able to do these pack openings for pack squads and then sell everything and get like so many subs back. Taylor Rogers definitely going into our bullpen as a lefty. Um, we'll take out Batances. He looked horrible today, and I don't like that he doesn't have a changeup. Let's keep it rolling. Let's keep it rolling. Got 21 packs left. Stephen Wright in that one, but we've already we we played Stephen Wright once. We're not gonna go that route again. Come on, baby. Come on, baby. Hit that thumbs up down below for good luck. Thumbs up for good luck. Go, Jeff McNeil. Put him on the bench for Will Smith for now, at the very least. Where do we play him? Too many infielders. I need Cody Bellinger. I need Cody Bellinger. Let Belly Bombs be the early in the year diamond like Christian Yelich was last year that runs the table with the main squad. Nothing but bronze in that pack. I'll take four bronze in a pack this time of year though. That very well may have been 2000 stubs. That very well may have been 2,000 stubs in that pack. Come on. Nothing there, 11 more. Got half of these standards to go. Blue, baby. 
Blue, baby. I'm going to bag it out, go back in, reset the pack luck. Reset the pack luck. Still got a 10 piece to go. Another gold, Ramon Laureano again. We pulled him in the last video. Still can't make up my mind between him and uh. uh there it is, baby! It doesn't look like we're gonna need Locaine or Ramon Laureano today. Whew, please be belly. Please be belly. National League left-handed closer. It's Josh Hader. Let's go. New closer on the squad. That's a massive pull. That's insane, actually. Huge. Our new closer. We can put him in for Sir Anthony Dominguez. Might rock with three righties in the bullpen for now. It's a good thing you can use your uh, starting pitchers out of relief if you have to. Beautiful. Beautiful. I had faith, man. Six more. Can we double dip? Can we double dip is the question. That would be massive. So I was I was gonna say I still I I didn't even I didn't put Loriano or Lorenzo Kane on the bench in this video despite saying I was gonna use one. There's a good gold. We'll flip him. We already have him. But I I was so, supposed to put one of the two on the bench for Will Smith and I didn't. Is what it is though. We got some pulls today. Jeff McNeil probably gonna replace that slot on our bench if we don't find a slot for him on the team. See if we can get one more. We got one pack left. Show me that blue one more time. Double dip them nachos, baby. No. Okay, let's go check out the team. Technically could put Jack, Jeff McNeil in the outfield. But again, I don't want to take Fran Mel Reyes out of, the, out of the lineup yet. He's nine for 19 with two bombs and seven ribbies in six games. That's crazy. That's crazy. He rakes. He rakes. Team looks good right now. Jeff McNeil, Mitch Garver. Devers, Peterson, Mondesi on the bench. I don't think we're gonna change anything. Hater's gonna be our new closer, but that's really the only change. All right, in the next game, we're gonna go back to Aaron Nola, and then after that, we will have Clayton Kershaw. 3,000 likes on this video, I'll put episode seven up on Saturday, and who knows, maybe I'll get another one up on Sunday. We'll see how you guys, uh, we'll see how we smash the thumbs up down below. Hope you guys enjoyed this video, man. I'm out, until next time, peace do these every year on the channel. I'm so hyped to bring them to MLB The Show 20. I'm going to play against another YouTuber or content creator. We'll probably do two of these a week. Depends on how busy we get. But what we're going to do is we're going to open up a 20-pack bundle. That's 20 standard packs and one gold player pack. We're going to build our team based off who we get in those packs. And then we're going to play against another creator in a five inning game. So we're going to put our team together as we go through the packs. In today's video, episode one of the pack and plays, we're going to play against ScoMo. ScoMo, mostly a mad.